coming over to visit with you guys. Hi, Jack. How you doing? I haven't seen you in a while. Hey, Pastor. What's going on? He's our neighbor. But what's going on with you two? Well, it's a long story. I had this beautiful princess castle, and he stole the piece I needed. Oh, okay. Pastor, I'm gonna have my superhero house. Okay. I see what's going on. Probably the same thing a lot of these kids are struggling with. You're home a lot more, and you find yourselves arguing a little bit more than before. Yeah, yeah. Do you guys know that there's a Bible verse that tells us that we should do everything in life without complaining or arguing? Did you guys memorize that verse? Well, I, I don't memorize things very easily. Yeah, that is hard. You know, I found that if you sing a Bible verse, oh. it seems to be easier to memorize. There's a verse in Philippians chapter 2 and verse 14 that tells us that we should do things, matter of fact, all things, without complaining or arguing. Would you guys like to learn it? Yeah. All right, I think the way we'll start it out is Gertrude, I want to hear you just say the word complaining. Complaining. And Jack, you want to help us? Sure. I want to hear you say the word arguing. Arguing. Very good. And then Bert, you've got a bigger phrase. I want to hear you say children of God. Children of God. Very good. So we're going to learn this verse together. Miss Heidi's here with us. She's going to help us. Let's sing it and you guys wait for me and I'll point to you when it's your turn. Do everything without complaining. Do everything without arguing. So that you can become blameless and pure. Children of God. Very good. You know, I think we could do that together. And I think Heidi could spice it up a little bit for us. What do you think? I like it. I like it. A little toe tapping. <clears throat> Let's do it together. Without complaining, do everything without arguing, so that you can become blameless and pure children. All together, one more time. Do everything without complaining. The truth is that the Bible has a lot to say about how we live and, and how we talk. And you know, the tongue gets us into a lot of trouble. You guys ever had anything this week, Mary? Maybe you said some things to your parents that you shouldn't have? Jack, you've been listening? Oh, yeah. <clears throat> There's another verse in the Bible. This was in Psalm 34 and verse 13. And this one says, keep your tongue from evil and your lips from speaking lies. Have you guys ever been tempted to tell a lie? Yeah, you gotta be careful. What about you, Jack? That's oh, right. No lie. Gotta watch those lips. So this one says, keep your tongue from evil and your lips from speaking lies. You guys wanna sing it together? Yeah. Psalm 34, verse 13. Keep your tongue from evil, keep your tongue. Keep your tongue from evil, keep your tongue. And your lips from speaking lies. Keep your tongue from evil, keep your tongue. Very good, one more time. Keep your tongue from evil, keep your tongue. Keep your tongue from evil, keep your tongue. And your lips from speaking lies. Keep your tongue from evil, keep your tongue. Very good. Now, the Bible tells us how we're supposed to live and how we're supposed to talk, but you know, there is a person in the Bible named Jesus. You guys know who Jesus is. Yeah. And Jesus, of course, was born on this earth and he grew up and he was a child just like you guys. Jack, were you a child at some point? Oh yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> and this verse is found in the book of Luke and it tells us that Jesus grew in wisdom and in stature and he grew in such a good way that it says he came in favor with God and men. Now this is the kind of song where I think you can learn it easier if I sing and then you guys repeat after me. What do you think? You ready to try that? Jack, you in for it? <clears throat> this is in the book of Luke, chapter 2, verse 52, and Jesus grew. Let's try it. Repeat after me, guys. And Jesus grew, and Jesus grew in, wisdom, in wisdom. And Jesus grew, and Jesus grew in, stature, in stature. And Jesus grew. And in favor, in favor with God, with God and, men, and men, and Jesus grew, and Jesus grew in wisdom, in wisdom, and 
Jesus grew. And Jesus grew. In stature. In stature. And Jesus grew. And Jesus grew. In, grew. in favor. In favor. With God. With God. And met a little and faster. Met. And Jesus grew. And Jesus grew. In wisdom. In wisdom. And Jesus grew. And Jesus grew. In stature. In stature. And Jesus grew. And Jesus grew. In favor. In favor. With God. With God. And men. Very good. Now, guys, you realize that just now we learned three Bible verses together. So, kids, I want you to play this video back over and over again. And by the time the week is done, you guys will have learned three Bible verses also. And these are Bible verses that are very important. And I think, guys, probably the one we're going to struggle with the most, most, especially since we're home alone together, is that first one about complaining and arguing. Why don't we finish up by singing that one, do everything without complaining or arguing. And then as we're singing it, I'm gonna kinda, I'm gonna kinda leave and listen as I walk down the block to see how you guys are doing with this song. So we'll sing it through twice. Let's try it. Ready, Bert? Ready. Do everything without complaining. Do everything without arguing so that you can become blameless and pure children of God. Very good, guys. I'll see you.